Hello and welcome to the Birmingham Post Business Bulletin. I'm going to speak to creative industry editor Anna Blackaby about how a precious metal could reap rewards for the jewellery quarter a bit later on. But first, National Express. We reported in today's post that the debt-laden bus group is being primed for a takeover. The company recently relinquished its costly East Coast mainline deal and rival first group was linked with a buyout. This morning it emerged that the Edgebaston firm's biggest shareholder, the Cosman family from Spain, were behind a new bid. A report in a national newspaper today claimed that the family was valuing the firm at more than £500 million, but National Express is said to be looking at closer to £620 million. Meanwhile, Anna's looking into a story about Palladium. Tell us about it, Anna. Um, well, Palladium is about to take a step up in the world with the news that the four UK assay offices can now legally hallmark the, the metal for the first time. And of course, this is of interest uh, to businesses in Birmingham, given our historic roots with the jewellery trade. And I mean, will this be a big deal for businesses in the jewellery quarter? Yes, it will. Um, manufacturers have been waiting for this for a long time um, and uh, palladium is growing in popularity because it's cheaper and lighter than platinum uh, and so makers in the jewellery quarter will be able to guarantee that quality to their customers and are expecting uh, an influx of new business on the back of this. Thanks Anna. You'll be able to find out more about both of these stories in Monday's Post. In the meantime, have a nice weekend. Walk, walk, walk.